Of the 109 known elements, the vast majority are metals. These are highlighted on the periodic table in green. While you may think of objects such as silverware, pans, and wires as metals, other elements such as calcium and sodium are also metals. Elements toward the middle and left, such as mercury, are also metals having metal-like properties, such as shininess, as seen in this aluminum foil, and are malleable, the ability to be shaped. Metals are also good conductors of electricity, such as that found in this electric fence. Generally speaking, metals also have a high density, as is the case with this piece of rapidly sinking lead. Magnesium, a metal commonly used to make airplanes, is in a specific family of metals called the alkaline earth metals, highlighted here in blue on the periodic table. The alkaline earth metals are a highly reactive group. For example, magnesium, seen here, brightly reacts when burned. Within the metals are the transition metals, seen here in green. They are less reactive than the first two groups of metals. There are many commonly used metals in the transition metals, including iron, used in making machinery and bridges, copper, used in wires and pipes, and tungsten, used in light bulbs. These shiny metals tend to be good conductors of electricity. Transition metals, such as iron, zinc, and cobalt, are also used to make colorful paints.